Hey yo, welcome back everybody to another Terraria video. Uh oh. Who let him out of the basement? But yeah, we are back here and we're doing an interesting video if you can tell by the title and thumbnail. We're checking out a mod that adds in pogo sticks and not only pogo sticks, but jackhammers. Now, what does a pogo stick do? It bounces you up and down, up and down, up and down. What does a slime mount do? Same thing, but you just go 10 times higher. So the slime mount also does a little something here. Let's uh, let's spawn an enemy, let's spawn in a zombie. Some slime mount does something really cool where you can actually hurt enemies. And it's really cool. It's actually, I'm pretty sure there's a couple uh, strategies to using this to kill some bosses. I think the Eye Cthulhu is one of the bosses that is really good to use the King Slime or uh, Slime Mount Strat on. But let's check out the Pogo Stick, okay? Now, as you can see, the Pogo Stick says 30 damage press down during a jump to bounce off of surfaces. So we're holding it in our hand right here. If we press down and then jump, boom, we're off. We're off. Now, this does 30 a hit. How much was the slime mount doing? I don't even remember. Let's put the slime mount back on. Uh, let's see. It was doing about 35 a hit, which isn't too bad at all. But let's go ahead. Let's try again. Boom. And then let's try the pogo stick. So it does do less, but it's a lot easier to uh, maintain the bounces too. You can keep your momentum on this. Oh, you can also use your wings as you can see. <laughs> but I don't know. This seems like a way faster method of transportation than the King Slime. So you may be asking, where do you get this specific item from? What mod and where? What character? What NPC? What drop? Well, the mod is the split mod. And the split mod is made by some of the devs from uh, Tremor. I know. I'm sorry that I said that word out loud. I'm not supposed to say that word anymore. So you get the pogo stick and the jackhammer from this NPC known as the Twilight Walker. You can find the Twilight Walker in the underground crimson and corruption or on its surface during the night. Much like the traveling merchant, it does not require a house to spawn. You can just find them wandering around and boom, that's how you get your hand on the pogo stick for five gold and the jackhammer for 12 gold. As you can see, the pogo stick is not a bad method of transportation at all. It's actually really fast. If you can just get your hands on it early game, you'll you'll literally be zooming across the world because this is like pretty good. I don't know what what kind of early mounts can you get that are fast. The bunny mount, I guess. <laughs> There's the bunny mount, and if you're playing modded, I guess you can get the scooter from the juice mod, and then the uh, crab mount from Thorium. But even then, you gotta be a couple bosses for the the crab mount, or not a couple bosses. You have to be queen jellyfish. You don't take fall damage, obviously. It's a pogo stick. I would hope not. But one thing you can actually do here, and uh, if you guys didn't know, I'm, I'm gonna have it in the description or maybe even in the comment section of the videos. I did do a challenge video of me using the pogo stick only, and uh, it's a pretty good video. I'm not gonna say anything else. I don't want to spoil if I beat the challenge or not. But it was it was a tough one to say the least. So let us move on to the jackhammer. Now this one you get, I believe, in hard mode. You can buy it from him. You can't buy this one in pre hard mode. This one you can, the pogo stick. But the jackhammer does 50 damage, 175% pickaxe power. You can destroy tiles by jumping on them while pressing down. Now this one is really, really cool because you can straight up mine with it. Now look at this. Oh my god, beautiful. Is there a way? I bet there's a way you can do some. Hold up. Let's put dirt above us like this. Take this out. Ooh, okay. Hold up. I'm trying to see if you can if you can make it go real fast. Oh, there you go. You see, I made it go a little fast for like a second. Now, let's go ahead. Let's put to the test what kind of ores we can mine. Because 175% pickaxe power. I don't know how high that is on the uh, ore list. Because I don't really, I don't know. To be honest, I don't really know how high uh, each ore is listed at percentage wise. So, as you can see here, we got a bunch of ores lined up to see if I can pogo stick all the way down to the bottom. Chlorophyte being at the bottom, adamantite next, mithril, cobalt. Crimtain, let's do it. Let's see how far we can go down this. I'm hoping to at least add a mantite. Okay, so we cleared that perfectly fine. Okay, okay, okay. Chlorophyte? Okay, it stops at chlorophyte. So that's actually not that bad at all. I'm saying it's not bad at all. Like you're actually going to be using a jackhammer to mine like this. <laughs> Since for some reason we are on the topic about mining and drills, I decided to go ahead and check out a couple more mods that add in special type of drills. From what I know, we have three. Leave more in the comments if you guys know of any more, but I know the impact drill from Thorium. Right clicking will fire tile breaking drill heads. I know the thorn drill from G Realm. Or is a thorn drill which mines tiles it hits and i know the dragon drill from sacred tools also known as shadows abaddon the last of its kind should not be used in space right click to change modes drill your way forward with immense force don't know why i read that from bottom to top but yeah let's go ahead we should probably start with the thorn drill which is the one you can get the earliest out of this bunch and uh, how you use it just pl plain and simple you just 
You just shoot it. It's a shootable pickaxe. I know, it's insane. It's actually really, really cool. Really, really cool because it's actually not that bad for mining down like that and uh, i could see it being used for a good couple of things especially you know if you need to mine down a big asshole or you just need to make a big asshole moving on to the impact drill now this one you know it's a pretty decent drill it's a uh, pickaxe powers 200 so it's actually really good but all you do to use this one you right click and it pretty much shoots a rocket and it's insanely good for mining like insanely good especially since this is a hard mode pickaxe 200% pickaxe power. I think it might be able to mine chlorophyte. We're about to see right here. All right, I guess I I spoke too soon. What's the point of that 200% if you can't even mine this? Moving on to the dragon drill. And uh, can right click to change the mode. Now, uh, this one is a little bit crazy. Let's go ahead. I'm just gonna hold down left click. Oh, and we're taking a flight. Beautiful, I know. It's like a, it's like a mount and a pickaxe in one. This is the flight mode. And if you right click, you're back into the drill mode. So let's see how it works out here. Uh, so you may be like, Gimmerders, why are you holding a gun? Well, there's one more thing that I want to show off in this video, and that is the drill bullets from the Juice mod. We have it, drill bullets, just a regular variant, molten drill bullets, hollow drill bullets, and laser drill bullets. Now, we're using the first one here. Break struck tiles, does a little but rapid damage, 50% pickaxe power. Let's see how deep each one of these bullets is gonna get. I'm using the mini shark because I'm assuming that this first variant is not gonna do too much damage here. It's actually not that bad with the mini shark. It's actually not that bad at all. Let's see how deep we can get. Okay, we got all the way down to the demonite, which is actually not bad at all. Let's go ahead. Let's try out the next variant, which is the molten one. It does 100% pickaxe power. I'm assuming it's going to do the same here. Just a lot faster. Yes, sir. Oh, it actually mines cobalt. It mines cobalt. Does it go deeper than that? Nah, that's pretty good. So the molten mines cobalt. It's actually really fast. If you really want to do a guns only playthrough, you know, the juice mods are allowing you to do that. That's like, that's a legit guns only. Like straight up. You don't even want to mine or nothing. But yeah, moving on to the hollow drill bullet. Let's go ahead. Let's try it on on this side. This one is 200% pickaxe power. I'm assuming it's going all the way down to chlorophyte. So uh, we're about to see. Yeah, a lot faster. Shredding through these last ores. Oh, it does get a little slower when you get to the higher tier ores. But it does go all the way down to chlorophyte. So that's pretty good. Now, the one that I'm excited for the most, the laser drill bullet always shoots right at your cursor. Okay, so this breaks them in pretty decent chunks. Jeez. And it's way faster. Yeah, it's even faster when you get to these lower tier ores. You can shoot them like this too. Beautiful beautiful now i can use my gun only playthrough we just need a we just need a gun that you know breaks trees wait doesn't this pretty much break trees it does all right so i found a couple more pickaxes from a couple of other mods we got the k-light pickaxe from qwerty's mod we got the drillinator and drillatron 5000 from the enigma mod and then we also have one more drill from g realm completely missed this one so let's go ahead let's just test out the uh k-light pickaxe mine's in a three by three area beautiful so you can straight up mine in the middle that's actually really really good <laughs> this is a good pickaxe to get your hands on because i know this is a fairly early game pickaxe in qwerty's mod so it's a nice pickaxe i like this a lot moving on though to the diamond drill it does say 200 pickaxe power so i'm assuming we could take a bite out of all of this yeah we can so that's actually that's pretty damn good look at that but moving on to the cooler ones, we have the Drillinator and we have the Drillotron. To the moon and to the core, I don't know what the difference is. We're just going to test it out and see. Now, I know what they do, but uh, you guys might not. Let's, let's, let's just go ahead and see here. Ah, interesting. <laughs> All right, what about the Drillinator? ah okay very very interesting at this rate my whole new creative world is gonna be destroyed but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video that started with pogo sticks and then ended up with drills and then ended up with guns that shoot drills but i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like and subscribe even leave a comment it could be a hateful comment whatever it doesn't matter because that's plus one to the algorithm i hope you guys enjoyed i love you guys full homo no homo whatever you wanted to be trying to extend this video to 10 minutes because you know 10 minutes is the best way to get full monetization whatever you want to call it i'm going to be streaming a forager i don't know what the fuck i'm talking about anymore i, I hope the video hit 10 minutes if it didn't hit 10 minutes there's gonna be a random clip and then the video all right ah! <laughs> what the fuck how am i supposed to fight this 
This is not fair, dude. <laughs> Alright, we're done.